Should I buy Sun Hydrogen Inc. stock? Sun Hydrogen closed the session of the 21st of April 2021 at $0 $0.1075, a 25.29% extension. Around 24.2 million stocks crossed that tape during that session, which was above average. And it says the price crossed below the 200 day trend line. During that session, the price actually dropped to $0.08, which was on average volume as at that time. We have a position in uh, Sun Hydrogen. Currently, I think the market cap is saying $357 million. Could that be the exact figure? Yes, okay, roughly that, that, that figure, yes. And we don't exactly have the short interest, but we will get some of the short figures in this video. I think the unbalanced volume indicator is uh, has a negative slope. Currently, the 14 period slow stochastic escalator is in the oversold territory, but it's uh, improving. MACD is um, just converged with the trend, the uh, signal line, and Sun Hydrogen appears to be consolidating within a longer term uptrend. So even with giving the 25% extension, it's still cons still considered. Uh, consolidating. The average directional index is below 20, indicating the shares have traded sideways recently. However, the 200 day trend line is sloping bullishly upwards, but it's lagging the SP 500. The momentum for Sun Hydrogen is strongly bearish. The 14 period to do stochastic escalator is below 20, as we pointed out earlier on. Yes, it's below 20. Um, the level which many analysts call also. This means that investors have been actively selling shares and at a level that is unsustainable in the long run. The volume for that session was lighter than usual, trading 24.174 million shares versus an average of 36.418 million shares per day during the last 12 months. The unbalanced volume indicator is, is bearish. The slope of the indicator is negative and suggests that there is a lack of buying interest. And it has a historical volatility of 245.89%. So, yes, um, yeah, I mean, much of what we just read out now were very much long term ish um, outcomes, uh, lasting up to 10 to 14 sessions. So, but uh, maybe because of uh, a sustained a sustained amount of retracements it has had this 25% ex uh, extension hasn't been enough to correct or um, change those outcomes so but all in all we evident ev can evidently see that has it has uh, extended by 25% and as at the 20th it was perfectly an excellent buy just a few a few cents away from the 200 day trend line as at that time it closed at the, closed the session of the 20th at 0 0.09 dollars and the, the 50 day trend line was the 200 day trend line was at 0 0.08 so we have at that point you know i can imagine even though i mean we there was no news concerning sun hydrogen it was just probably a technical play and also if you add up all that is going on concerning the green drive by the Biden administration the interest in <clears throat> of market participants in getting involved with uh, green tech and other stuff you know if you combine all of those things the the technical advantage they has he has uh, pr provided as at that 20th you know it was definitely a buy and it's still even though it has extended by 25% it's still not trading at the premium to its short term trend lines, just very much the same as then. It is just the 50 day trend line that is also bearish, sloping downwards. You know, it's, um, it's, that's the, that's the barometer now, you know, so given that it's trading below that intermediate trend line, it's, I would still say that the technical advantage is still there, you know, but you, at the same time, you have to balance the fact that it has extended by 25%. There's a good chance that it's it's uh, it's signaling that you probably have to just hold on now. That some people might want to sell, you know, take take uh, some money off the table as it concerns that twenty five percent extension. So um, I can definitely uh, 
sad that uh, this extension it had was definitely was uh, was um, as as a result of taking advantage of uh, a technical advantage that uh, resulted, you know. So, I mean, it's th this this we can evidently see that um, these these uh, technical advantages, this uh, by the deep opportunities are real. You know, we can clearly see that it happened here. And you know, if you got in here, you know, you are definitely looking at or uh, you're definitely counting it to twenty five percent gain if you didn't sell off earlier on so um easily easily technically technically it's still the opportunity is still there but has diminished uh, fundamentally um there is definitely um, nothing um uh unequivocal uh, there's nothing doubtful about sun hydrogen and uh, on a macroeconomic level it has the uh, the, the, the 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 ear i would say Allow me to say that it has the interest of uh, the wider government. You know, um, its um, ambitions and policies are definitely the sort that will definitely favour the the stock. So um, easily, it is a buy, but at the same time, now it has extended by twenty five percent. You really have to be cautious. Just hold on and see what's going to happen next. Okay, so if you're new to this channel, subscribe, like, and share. If you're really a subscriber, thank you very much for watching this video.